Hello guys and welcome back to the latest video of an old rounder and today we are going to play Minecraft we are back here in our world and first of all let me show you all the things that we got from this zombie slash ground farm over here it is working beautifully currently I don't think we would have any zombies because I just killed them all just a fact if you don't know you have to stay within a little bit radius of uh, your farm for it to generate stuff so as you can see in this chest over here we have two swords lots of you know shovels we had almost three more of swords and two more of shovels we, which we just used and we have on our side iron gear we have almost 20 or 30 pieces of chain armor hem helmet leggings and all that including here we have all the enchanted stuff with few of them really nice like blast protection 4 projectile protection 4 and projectile protection 4 and i'm also wearing this blast protection 2 and projectile protection 4 iron armor stuff and uh, right over here in this chest we had all the normal golden armor leggings and all that this was full and we got over 10 pieces of gold ingots from smelting all of that and almost two or three iron ingots from smelting this over here is just my personal stuff and uh, overall we got almost 30 or 40 gold ingots not gold nuggets gold ingots 30 or 40 from my last batch in which i fk for almost 15 minutes to half an hour not really sure so let's go up and yes i have also created a way to the castle because sometimes while fking it just gets darker so over here you can go through this tunnel and you will enter up in our castle directly right that's all for this let's go out and yes we found this area we were we went in a tunnel i don't know where the tunnel started but we went in the tunnel and i ended up in this area over here which is basically a slime chunk surrounded lots of I don't know exact locations and um, I at the correct place yes we are at the correct place let's go down so all of this area is basically comes under slime chunk over here I saw slimes I saw them up this area they are sometimes over here in this tunnel sometimes so basically this area is just surrounded by slime chunks and it randomly generates slimes I don't know the exact chunk location because I am playing in beta version of minecraft so I have not created anything but I just got over a stack of slime yesterday within 15 minutes or so which is enough for a very long time for me because I am not doing that much uh, you know redstone and stuff uh, I just forgot uh, where is that thing yes over here is the way to another tunnel I just created a little bit of shortcut you can say and you will travel from here straight up in this cave tunnel whatever you wanna call it I have just sealed all the ways in and out except this one and created a little bit of safety barrier kind of stuff let's go down here 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 and when you will enter you will see here we have ourselves a skeleton spawner like that's really nice stuff so first of all let me think I think this area over here would uh, be a nice point to enter overall means I'm going to take my zombie uh, sorry 
skeletons over towards this side right so first of all i need to dig if i remember it correctly 1 2 3 4 4 on each side 1 2 3 4 1 2 don't need it right now 1 2 3 and 4 every we have cleared out all of this area so finally we have cleared out all of this area and just for checking let's just put a bucket of water whether this is all right or not well it's working nicely this is where the mobs are going to end up and let's take two blocks down from here right here it goes and now uh, for one minute let's place a torch over here when we place this bucket of water this is going to end up over here and if i place another bucket of water over here so basically this is the center if i dig down from here I should end up All right now I have to dig from here and that is going to basically take the mobs all the way to the place where we want them to end up so this tunnel can be lit up if we want to let's count 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 i think water should go somewhere around should go till somewhere around here well till here so from this block we will have to dig to get our mobs to the required position well let's eat something right 1 2 3 4 5 6 7th and 8th block is where the water will go so 1 2 3 all right not really what i was looking for but we just ran into another cave over here falling gravel over here and over there and right there is a creeper ready to die well he just blasted himself off really convenient let's close this and we will just see let's close these things for now we will see later what we have to do and let's place torch so that we can see clearly what we are dealing with so right here the mossel and right so this is first second third fourth we will count in a second which block is this before that let's just complete this well here we go let's just count our blocks for once 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 7 this is the seventh block or eighth one It's just always a little bit confusing to deal with these things. So right here they will end, 
and I am not sure but I think that uh, skeletons over time lose their health come on good oh, I have to reach and take that water off from there to do what I want to do like I wanted to do this but I need to get up before doing that one two and three blocks so this is so we can jump over this hole without falling in so zombies will end up in this hole over here after which uh, we can kill them basically uh, now we do have to test this thing so let's place a torch over here water source over there and this should take the torch exactly in this hole indeed it did so it's working properly now let's check once this is where the mobs will get spawned this from here they will be taken all the way to this hole and i will stand somewhere around here i don't know from where I'm going to kill them or they are going to die themselves we just really need to get that have to search for the fact of whether zombies sorry whether skeletons lead uh, or not that's a nice thing to know that will be a nice thing to know I mean Let's make a little bit of space over here for us to do whatever we have to do. Right, so here we are. Exactly here they will end up in this hole and I think uh, just we will just have to deal with the fact that they are going to do it or not first of all we need to find our way up for which uh, i don't know i have i am for sure i don't have enough stairs for it so this is decreasing over there and access increasing over here i have to i'm at uh, 177 and 559 so basically I have to go this way we'll end up somewhere close to the base but I don't think our shovel can take that much for now we don't have any other option let's go as we will have to go from the mob spawner area let's go to almost z is equal to 50 from where i think we can go up using the here we are on 41 well nice to see a lit cave that basically means we have ended up in the exact cave that we used to go to the mob spawner right and around here must be my exit yes it's right over there well we are not stuck and this can do the job for now 
and over here must be our original way to the mob spawner and now we need to here is our way to the mob spawner now we need to put water in the original places before doing all that I need to go down and I have to take some damage for going down right we removed all of that now let's take the slabs to reach up One slab over there, one over here, one over here, one over there. No, 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 I don't think over here. That will be wrong. Over here and over here, and the last one should be. Let's see if we can climb all the way up. using this little way of ours okay this is a little too high i guess so we can use this to get ourselves an exit out of here before which we will have to deal with all the lighting and stuff so let's place water over here wait it is not going all the way there hi now that's confusing if i place water over here it is going all the way all right it's because of this thing no right that's not an issue then let's just make ourselves a standing platform too that is not working right let's get rid of that then Let's get ourselves a normal cobalt stone block to stand on while we place all the water. So we place it over here. We must get ourselves an infinite water source. Right, that's done. All of these guys will get pushed to there. Let's fill up two buckets of water for this thing come on no guys that's bad and that's even worse that's worse 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 come on come on take it up right oh no I don't know why things get messed up so that we can get above get rid of this block over here then we can come here get rid of that block the water mechanics of minecraft is, are really weird anyway if i place this over there get rid of this torch and if i place that Come on, that's wrong thing. This over here, all the zombies must now flow that side. I can go over there, get rid of this block, and then we can just remove all this lighting, which will be really tough because of the zombies. Well, let's get up get rid of these let's see if the water is going properly all the way yes and that's going in there really nice for us to know let's come at almost no i think we need to go a little more higher we can get rid of the lower blocks now we need to get rid of all the lighting can we reach there not at all let's see 
let's go up get rid of this we can just get rid of all of that block and place another one over there did we just have a za skeleton spawn somewhere absolutely yes so they have started spawning and i'm trying to get rid of all the light so that the rate can overall increase let's get rid of that we will need to go a little bit that side we do have some more slabs with us come on they can spawn anywhere and try to shoot me down let's place uh, this over there that area is fully done no one getting rid of these I think all the torches are just removed we can get not we can get rid of these two then we can get rid of these two we can have our way back over here we can get rid of the last one just in case yes one of torches left over there I hope nothing is left now. So basically, they are going to spawn over here, and they are going to find their way all the way there. Let's just now let's get rid of this and let's place this over here. Right, so here we are, and that. Thing is the thing that we need. I don't have any signs. Let's just place a lots of torches as a remembrance that this is the area where we have to come. Let's get over here and right here is our way down. I guess we will find out if everything is working properly. If not, then I'm going to be mad. Nice. He's trying to come. And currently, yes, they can come. I understand the fact and the risk factor in this. Come on, do die already. We might be having few over here. Now let's place. Two slabs, right? Like this, I guess. And maybe just three. Are we out of slabs? We have just one more slab. Need slabs, so let's replace this with cobalt stone block. Let's go two blocks down over here. Eight. I thought. Now over here would be the skeletons, right? Let's just replace this with a slab. Then we can get rid of this and replace this with a slab. And we can punch them off. And just in case, we can go one block down. Get this, get rid of this, and then we can place this thing. They cannot see us, they cannot hurt us, but we can hurt them. Now we don't even need that access point over there. It's all right. We can go all the way up from here. We must not be really far away from home anyway. We are around 100 blocks away from home. Uh, we will see that all thing later. Later, not later. 
now we have to deal with the afk point and just in case are they taking damage no they are not taking any kind of damage what if i place one water source block not here what if i place a water source block over there and then i place myself a slab over here basically i don't think they are going to take any damage from that we'll just have to punch them ourselves not really exciting let's make ourselves an afk point all which all we have to do is we have to go over there obviously we have to light this up let's count one second how many blocks are we from this this must be the seventh block One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Here must be the depression, and this must be the seventh block of another one. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. And I think somewhere around here must be the water right over there. Well, so we have to get up, and we'll have our. FK spot somewhere around there. No, that's wrong. Do we have a sh uh, out of things right now? We just need to get back to the home, grab ourselves some items. This must be the way back to home, and I need food. Let's grab ourselves some food while we are trying to climb up. so that we can get running and it's raining really nice it just started raining means i would not have mobs around me and that's nice to know do we have any extracts already no Sorry, not the X. Let's see all of these. Stack upon stacks of cobalt stone. Nice stack of mossy cobalt stone. Let's get rid of this. That. No, we don't have that. We have some of this. We have little bit of coal. We have two water buckets, three water buckets over here. We need some more wood. We need to get rid of this bow. Bows are actually nice for making dispensers. We need to keep this stuff with us, I guess. Now we need to make ourselves some pickaxes, for which we are going to need more wood. Can we convert this into that? Then we can convert that into that, and finally we can go over here with obviously iron. Not ten, nine pieces of iron. Get three of these, and if we can sleep, no, we cannot sleep right now. Though it is raining, so 
we need wood for making nice quantity of chests Getting wood is not the toughest thing for me right now. Wait, that tree will be really tough to cut down anyway. I am not going to cut it all the way because I don't have time right now. Let's just grab us a little bit of wood and get back home to see. get over there convert come on convert all of this into planks we need one workbench to keep at least two chests one hopper that would be in the zombie mob spawner let's get over there quickly for a minute and yes i do need some signs that would be really helpful to have some signs to know where my stuff is that is over here i must have gone for current two more of these Well, that's all we needed from here. Right now, let's get back up. No, 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 no. What are you doing, dude? Let's get over here. So we have most of the stuff that is required. For the coordinates, I just forgot they were something 600. So that will be over there if I'm not wrong. So basically, our skeleton farm is a little far away from the home. And I'm just trying to get a better way to reach there and come from there. No, 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 I'm at the wrong place, I'm in the wrong place. We don't have to go all the way. We just need to get over here. Let's go. Getting down here. We would have our skeletons. They just despawn, perfect. Really nice to know that. Right, and now I think I must go up from here if I am correct. This over here, we need some of this. I will go up by 4 blocks or 5 blocks basically. We don't need that over there. Let's get to the sneak mode. Reach all the way on the top. Get rid of two blocks from here. One block from there and that must take us to this thing. That's nice. But yes, I just want to see that for once. Yes, the skeletons are getting spawned. Wait, just one more skeleton to make sure that they are constantly getting spawned. Similar to our, you know, zombie farm. Yes, now I do want to find 
a way all right very nice they are just killing themselves off so basically if they see me which they can if i get to slap from here come on check 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 i'm so dead 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 ah nice that could have been end of us is that confused due to this thing what weird is the plan we need to get rid of this we need to grab these we need to place one of these over here one of these over here so we have one block space right here and our shield is about to break pretty quickly before all of that things let's get over here for a sack and that's not right i just was about to tell we will need to get rid of these blocks what we need over here is a chest a single chest and there will be the zombie here will be the hopper here should be these guys i don't know from here i can get the hopper attached to the chest or not i don't think so i would have to just come on dude you can be at the right Place. Well, nice. We can get rid of two blocks from here, and then quickly do this, that, and we can now get back to what we were doing. Then I will break. this block over here water will flow like that now we need a slab over here all right it's over here not there we need a slab over here we can open that our stuff will go there we still have the one block space that we need let's check this up Do we have any skeleton spawn? Yes, we do have him. Now oh, he's just going to stand over here, looking at me. The bees guys are just not going to attack me, but still we are getting the loot. that i was talking about we are getting a lot of things from here so guys our farm is up and it's working pretty well as you can see and now we don't need this big space because we know that they are not going to attack us from there but that happened once here So let's just see if that can happen again. 
They will just try to attack us. Hopefully they could not attack us. Maybe then they are just going to hurt each other and die there. Die in the way. So just maybe they are going to kill us. We still need a nice way to kill them. Maybe we are going to find it fast. Soon, not fast. Any slab over here, dude? Now it's I think nice, ready to go. When they will come over here, they can see us, they will not attack us. And we can just kill them using a shovel because we have lots of shovels from there. I mean from the zombie farm. Really nice if we can just get ourselves a looting spot. That would really help. We have all of these broken stuff. Well, alright. Now we need to make a way all the way up, right? Which is going to be a tough task. First of all, yes, I just forgot about it. Let's make a chest room over here. First thing will be this. Then here I'm just going to have chests. Chests, I guess. We have this way out anyway so now let's do that and now we have to make ourselves some stairs and find our way back to the surface we are at 26 and we have to go to almost 60 70 so let's get a little bit more because anyway they are not going to get wasted so we have 40 now and hopefully that will be enough grab that do that run over here get sneak then we can do that one block here for the torch to go you can just climb up like that and get rid of these are we above the river no i don't think so anyway we will find out soon quickly Uh, where is the shovel? Where is the shovel? It just broke. Really nice. Hopefully we just did it correct.
let's grab the ladders and let's get up standing here then we can get rid of more blocks As it is getting to day not to night and I just thought it was getting to night well all right we have most of the things that we need to quickly make a little bit of kind of you know something to remember that that is over there I mean the entrance to the skeleton farm is over here that's just temporarily place cobalt stone blocks like we always do and then it becomes permanent because we are too lazy to complete it get these like that alright one more like that and we are pretty much done by placing this block over here and getting this completed well that's nice Yes, and indeed he was here, I was just thinking we have someone around us this guy just have gunpowder in his hand, how funny it is did he just
well that's what you get for messing with me that's what i got two gunpowder nice set of golden armor just to melt now we need ourselves a gate and i am not interested in going all the way back to the home for just a gate so let's place this over here and get ourselves one gate to put here now indeed we can make a tunnel all the way back to home but for that we will need shovel at least Let's use these. Whatever we have, because I don't care about the looks right now. Come on, dude, that's not nice. I'm not going to eat rotten flesh. I'm going to eat pumpkin pie because it is just easy to get. Do we have cobalt stone? No, all we have is dirt and. So let's make it one block thicker, basically. So this way will go all the way below there, right? What is the depth? of this place it is still 56 so we can go around 54 or something and you can just straight up mine till 5 something it's all just messy so guys thanks for watching this video today we learn how to make a skeleton dungeon which is pretty awesome with almost you know very basic resources we just didn't use any kind of redstone except for the hoppers if you count them in redstone so all we used for this one is hopper but the only problem now is we have to kill the skeletons manually and that's not exactly what i wanted but there is a method in which uh, i think we can use uh, the new campfire i think it can hurt mobs and it will not burn the stuff that they will drop so we are going to try that in the testing world so guys thanks for watching this video see you all in the next video bye take care and sayonara